welcome back. So we did have mostly cloudy skies through the entire day. Just a few peaks of sun here and there with some really widely scattered showers. One hitting the North Platte area into the mid afternoon. Other than that, most of the moisture has been into our eastern counties. We did start to clear out pretty nicely as we made our way through late into the afternoon into early evening. But temperatures, even with the clouds, did really make it up there to above average levels. Should be around 71 this time of year. We made it to 74 at Imperial North Platte and Lexington, still into the lower 70s at Ogallala and Broken Bow. And as you make your way up toward uh, Thedford Valentine into the upper 60s, here's a look at your current temperature. So we have fallen about 20 degrees from our highs. We're at 55 in North Platte and Lexington, mid 50s also at Imperial, near 50 as you make your way from Ogallala and out toward Broken Bow. Now the winds are light. 0 to 10 miles per hour, mainly from a northerly or a little bit of a northwesterly direction. So it's still pumping in that cool air. We've got clearing skies and light winds, so it's going to be a, a cooler overnight because of that. So that, uh, that little shower that was around Stapleton looks to be dissipating, and that should be the last of the moisture. Most of the moisture off to our east right now in the form of rain, and we're losing the clouds also. Now we got this low pressure system working its way off to the east, so the moisture is associated with that. We got that dry and cool north northwesterly flow, but high pressure is going to be in charge of our forecast for the next 24 to 36 hours. So, uh, as uh, we make our way through time, these features will move off to the east. The high will crest over us. So, lots of sunshine as we make our way through the next couple of days, and even a little bit of a warm up for the day tomorrow with more of a southerly wind. We'll keep that sunshine and be into the mid 70s once again. But this cold front will make its way through and uh, we will be a lot cooler as we make our way through the end of the week and start the weekend. More on that later, but high pressure's in charge for the weekend, so back to sunshine. So here's a look at the sky cast. We got those light northerly winds, temperatures falling from where they are now into the, from the mid-50s into the mid to upper 40s. That's where we'll start off the day tomorrow with mainly clear skies. And then as we go through the day on Wednesday, even with sunshine, we still got that northerly wind. So we're going to be back to the temperatures that we had today. Loaded mid 70s but going through the day on Thursday and into the day on Friday first off starting off your Thursday into the low to mid 40s so seasonably cool we'll say high temperatures on Thursday with a stronger northerly or even a northeasterly wind which will produce a little moisture in the form of clouds will still stay mainly dry those highs getting into the uh, upper 60s and maybe even some lower 60s into our eastern counties but after that we have a strong cold front making its way through that low moves off to our east some rain moving into the Midwest, but also moving into the Midwest and eventually the Northeast, the 70s and 80s that were common, especially over the last few weeks. So the warm air moves off to the east. We got this cool air mass. It's going to work its way down Thursday night and be over us for the day on Friday. And also the tail end of this cold front gets into our viewing area, and that will increase the clouds and give us a chance of some showers once again, especially on Fridays, well, on Friday with those high temperatures only into the 50s. So here's the forecast for tonight. We will have clear skies and it will be cool with temperatures into the mid to upper 40s. We're going to keep that northerly wind tomorrow, sunny skies, temperatures back into the mid 70s, a little warm for this time of year, but into the upper 60s and lower 70s for the day on Thursday. The cooler air continues to filter in, mostly sunny skies, but the coolest air will be here for Friday with the clouds and the rain chances, especially into the afternoon and evening, a high of only 51. Then back to that high pressure we looked at for the weekend, lots of sunshine Saturday and Sunday. Monday, upper 60s to near 70, near 70 on Monday, mostly sunny and mostly sunny and warmer dry on Tuesday with a high of 76. Kent? So not bad tomorrow, but then it kind of goes south after that. Yep, so we have another moisture chance and just a little cooler for Friday. All right, thanks so much, Justin. If you are one of the millions of Americans with credit card debt spread across multiple cards, well, we've got some expert advice on managing your money. And just watching your wallet, consumer investigator Rachel DePompa examines ways to get your debt under.